That's bizarre. Huh. Well, anyway, I want to go back. We'll probably have a teleport later where I'm like, okay, I think I'm done exploring here. I will now go back and retrieve the money again and have the phone call again and so on and get back to where we haven't seen yet. I think there's more shit to do in this building, probably. Or look around, at least. I felt like I pretty much... I feel like the... It was one of those things where the first thing I tried kept being exactly where I'm supposed to go, apparently. It was that hole that worked out. We, we searched this whole office. That was all from going through here, but isn't there more shit to do? Like the archives? Got those archive keys, I never use those. Or even the other floors. Aha! You shut up. Dahlberg Steel, our part? Walter? Former workers? Our members? Union fee is paid? Check the archives for more information, shelf 516. An article where the workers blame us for the collapse. Must clean up reputation. Alright, so shelf 516 in the archives. Something to keep in mind. We already have access to the archives, thankfully. If I can find the right spot. Oh, that opens now. Oh. That was you. This guy's confusing sometimes. <laughs> so I think the way it works is that if it beeps red, that, mean I, that means I don't have the key. But if it, uh... If it doesn't beep, then that means that it's not sensing me because of inter interference. That seems to be how to tell the difference. Okay, well then let's go back down. Seems like we only have two access to two floors. And that one looks pretty finished. But if nothing else, there's the archives, right? There we go. Shell 516. Plus or minus anything else I can find. Five eleven. How is everything here dated five eleven? It better be like May of two thousand eleven. Holy crap. Oh no, eventually get to eights. But then it goes back to fives? What the hell? Maybe it's a tax code number or something like that. That isn't like what I think it is. Oh, we're inside the library. Okay. This is neat to be inside of. Ooh, batteries. Can't carry anymore. Really? They're camera batteries. Someone's got a pillow in here. Have they been sleeping in here? Storing their pet in here. <laughs> I still have nine packs of batteries left. That makes ten packs of camera batteries. I ain't wasting no camera batteries. Or in leaving them at least. Stalberg Times. Stalberg Steel collapsed. Have I read this before? Pre yeah, President of Egypt. Stalberg wins football league. Budget cuts. Metal workers being blamed. Yeah, Stalberg Steel was collapsed, the union was blamed, and the city council announces budget cuts. Either I've already read that before, or it's some, or it's just stuff we already know. Because it's super familiar sounding. The Metal Workers Union, Stalberg Steel, Operation Will of Steel. Alright, comrades. 
1310-1981. Mark that date up because that will be the day when we strike at Stahlberg Steel. And we will strike hard. On that date, the corrupt ownership of Stahlberg Steel will fall into our hands. The workers are fed up and willing to strike. Our men and women in the facility are ready and waiting for our command. On the 13th day, the majority of the factory's management are away in an important corporate meeting as at SBS headquarters. And the whole factory is entirely staffed by our members and common workers. The plan, just before lunch hour, when workers are hungry, one of our activists will announce that, due to recent layoffs and cuts, we can't serve lunch today. Instantly after that, our, acti our activists will go and strike, chanting slogans that encourage the workers to join the strike. The hunger and cumulative anger towards the owners and the worsened working conditions will cause even the most devoted of the Walter loyalists to join the class struggle. This strike will allow us to tighten our grip on the giant money-making factory and possibly even shift its ownership to us. Interesting. Dahlberg Bank? Hmm. We saw a bunch of those before. No, the same books I see everywhere else, somehow. Uh, no new information. Just the usual stuff about... Here we go. I can probably die if I get caught in there. Oh my god, this one's just full of beer. Oh my goodness. Photograph that, huh? <laughs> Is it the bear? The bear and the dragon. That was no new information, really, but it's just the context from the people that actually were doing it themselves, their exact plan, but we <laughs> someone's got wood inside of it and garbage bags and fans. What the hell? That makes ten packs of batteries for the flashlight. So how do I know what 516 is, by the way? Is that just where the newspaper was? Is that all, is that all the 516 was? Or is, is number 16 somewhere around here going to be openable? Wait, there's a 17 on that side and a 17 on that side. What is this numbering system? Wait, what? Every four of them is the same numbers over and over again. I mean, every eight of them. That's... In, but those ones are different. <laughs> One, two, seven, eight, thirteen, fourteen, nineteen, twenty. Five, six, eleven, twelve, seventeen, eighteen, twenty three, twenty four. But then those repeat here and here. What the hell? I'm thinking I'm not supposed to be looking for five, sixteen... Among them, then, if the numbers make no sense. But also, it said 516, but these things aren't numbers, they're letters. So I'm, like, confused by that, too. Oh my god, there's more. I don't think I can fit these in my pockets. I heard people say they ran out of camera batteries in this game. I wasted one at the beginning, and I'm doing fine. Hey, metal men, we sent you a gift. Best regards, VW. P.S. We're, we're the strongest union in the city. That's not evidence? Alright. One, two, three, four, five. I oh, can't do it that way. This is one possible interpretation of the number five. The issue is that the that uh pretty sure sixteen literally doesn't come up on these because of the weird repeating numbers. And this is supposed to be looking for like around here. Where is archive shelf five sixteen? Are you five sixteen? 
You're like 7-Eleven. I don't know how to look for 516. I'm confused about this. One, two, three, four, five. Is this the more? Uh, is this the more information? The thing that's just full of alcohol? Is it? Was it? The, is the code for here's where all the booze is hidden? Or is this somehow interpretable as 516? Huh. I'm just not all that sure what I'm supposed to be doing. But I looked everywhere in the archives, I think, so if it was there to be found, I found it, right? That's where I came from, right? Yeah. Nothing to do there. You open now. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, this gives me access. If I came through this way, it gives me access without having to deal with uh, getting locked in via falling in. So at least there's that. Huh. Well, all right then. I'm just gonna retrieve money again in case this ever comes up. Daily withdrawal limit is reached on account, or, or account is empty. <laughs> I have no idea how much money I have. I think I retrieved 500, like, Four or five times, then I had to retrieve 200 at one point. And then it either dropped to 50 or something, or it just didn't let me retrieve anymore. I forget, actually, what it was at that point. I'm irrationally, un like, bothered by the idea that his freaking... His pin is 1337. Are you serious? Swoop. Yeah, he's gonna do that phone call again. Alright. Hey, uh, I'm at the metro station. That shortcut you sent me on was a fucking death threat, but I made it here in one piece. Just one problem. The station's closed, and I think I'm locked inside. There's some kind of an angry mob outside. Oh, shoot. I forgot about the protest. Uh, could you hang on a second? I might have some strings that I can pull. Yeah. I'm so confused by our protagonist's voice acting. Like, some of the other characters sound like they understand what they're saying. <laughs> but, I don't know what it is, but our... Our protagonist seems to sound like he maybe doesn't even know what the words are he's saying. Like, he's just... Learned, learned the lines phonetically, and he's reading them out. But he doesn't know which... Like, what to emphasize, or what tone to have each word at. Every single word sounds like a question. That shortcut you sent me on is a fucking death trap. But there's some kind of a protest outside. I'm like, I don't, I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand his speaking voice. It's so confusing. How did he land on that? As like, like that's that's the best approach, obviously. Ah, uh, excuse me. Someone should get that fixed. Okay, the the glowing mushrooms are just in the open. Are you serious? This is a, I mean, it's a closed station. Maybe that's why it's closed. But damn, that was a dick move, by the way. Video game killing me like that. Ooh, I can go this way. That's a dick move killing me by like, oh, you touched the rails, you're just instantly dead. All right. Mark, you still there? Yeah. I called someone who works at the metro, and there should be a maintenance tram somewhere around there. He unlocked the door for you. Take the tram and get back to the office. We need your help in here. I'll be there soon. Yeah. Huh. Here I thought- here I'm thinking I'm poking around potential secrets and, and they seem to be responding like, Oh, by the way, this is where you're supposed to go. Did I dip under the main platform and then come out the other side? Of the main area? Came from up there, then I went down there, and came up over here- okay. Oh man, SMT equals greed, Stahlberg, mass transit, go to hell. They seem happy. So none of you see me in here, huh? I can't like, help me, I'm stuck. I feel like I should just put up a sign that says help, I'm stuck. Did you use, how dare you? 
Wait, what? Ew. Ew, you're a- you, this sign is a disaster. First of all, there's the woodcut stuff, which is already like, really, you're gonna do woodcut stuff in the middle of a freaking subway station? That fits the aesthetic. But also, like, they did the burn text. But then, like... <laughs> uh... Every letter there, except the G, is papyrus font, which is already, like, egregious enough, because, like, papyrus is up there with chiller and comic sans of, like, really, you're gonna use that font? By the way, I have a axe to grind about the, the font chiller, because as somebody whose job it is to pay attention to new releases of video games a lot, uh, every time I look at Steam's new releases, every single week another horror game, or horror-ish game, comes out on Steam, and its goddamn logo is chiller font, and I'm like, you, do you know how many people use that font? Right now, there's a Halloween sale on Steam, and that Halloween sales font is chiller font. Not the title, but the description under it is in chiller, and I'm like, god damn it. I thought this font was edgy when I was like seven. And it's been, that was 20 years ago. Get a new font. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, this, that's S-P-U-R and O-S are all in papyrus. But the G is in a different font. I need to photograph this. There we go. Get that fixed. Disgusting. How dare they, frankly. Aziz's burger and kebab! I found the kebab. Oh, and it opens. Nobody even cleaned up before they left. What the hell? Ew, the food's still out. I mean, it's about as sanitary as I always kind of figured kebab was. <laughs> I don't know anything. I, I don't eat kebab and don't know anything about kebab, honestly. But I, I always saw the spinning meat thing on a stick just sitting there in the open air all day. And I'm like, I don't know if I trust this place as a food source. I don't know how I feel about that. They sell burgers, a stall, the stall burger, because it's, <laughs> that's funny, the Stallberg stall burger, falafel burger, hot bacon burger, some super special burger, bunch of kebab, pita kebab, feta cheese kebab, bunch of pizzas, vegetariana, al tono, Stallberg special, no one wants a Stallberg pizza, Bernays pizza, the combat fighter, what? Aziz's special drink. I made it special. Gonna have to get that fixed up later. On law enforced coffee break. Okay, they didn't abandon it. He's on his he's on his coffee break apparently right now. And all this meat is just open. What are you even a gonna? First of all, who's mess is this that hasn't been cleaned up and who you're on a coffee break this place is running no one's this place is locked up i have so many questions right now oh that one actually didn't want me to photograph it whoops metro workers to protest today i've heard this one before too because it's today's paper yeah kebab hamburger radioactive hamburger walter square yeah, it's the anniversary of the accident and the protest is happening. We've read this before. You know what? No. I'm gonna leave the door open. I want you to feel like maybe the food conditions are questionable. I don't know. Listen, I'm basically just going for a joke. It's fine. Interestingly, the character auto-ducks under that thing. I almost wonder if they were worried that, they w that people wouldn't think they could go past the tape, because... That flimsy guard is how is what a lot of uh, games use as like you can't go this way mechanic in their linear shooters. So I kind of wonder if they were like worried you wouldn't realize you could crouch under it because your character auto crouches. And I don't really remember him ever doing that in this game before. That feels new. And where do you go? I have like a ton of these things already. Is this just a flashlight battery location? That would appear to be the case. I still have nine packs of batteries left. 
Might as well keep things topped off. So I can make more stupid jokes about things to photograph. <laughs> Well, at least this place isn't going to have a cave-in, most likely, because it was in use, like, yesterday. And is a public area, and has nicely, freshly painted modern cement and stuff. Listen, I'm just saying I might not be dead soon. Might have a chance. Bullock Sugar Flakes, I forgot about those. How do your physics work? Oh, reasonably. I was hoping for a repeat of the flashlight, but I was, uh, it was ripped from my grip because I saw the flashlight and it wouldn't let me pick it up. I'm like, no! That one time they let me pick one of these up was amazing. I'm guessing there's just, like, no physics applied to that thing, so it just spins around everywhere. Because I've only been able to pick up one of them so far, and that one had no idea how to deal. I'm guessing this is the tram. I feel like I'm not qualified to use a subway, a metro tram. And I should be worried about, like, whether I'm going to immediately crash into another person. I've, that must have been the tram keys, right? Like, I should be very worried that I'm going to crash into somebody else's actual professional train and I'm going to be uh, super dead and get a lot of people killed. Why is there a shovel in, a, in here, of all places? Stahlberg Times. Same day, but different newspaper, it looks like. Stahlberg nuclear power production about to double. BlackRock nuclear power plant to build a third reactor by 2022. The new reactor will produce more energy than the old two combined. Stahlberg Industry Power SIP has announced that after several major setbacks, the BlackRock 3 reactor will finally begin operation in the spring of 2018. The third reactor has been under construction since 2008 and supposed to be finished in 2012, but because of multiple issues, the product has been prolonged time uh, project has been prolonged time and time again. The new plant will use the newest EPR type reactor, which is a third generation pressurized water reactor design. The raw output of the new reactor will be roughly 1600 megawatts, which puts the current two 780 megawatts BWR reactors to shame. Stahlberg wins yet another game. Art is the mental problem of its creator. Art graphician Samuel Lake says he just can't stop doing art. Passion keeps the game going. Metro workers to protest today. That's not new. New metal detectors causing problems in the, at, at SA, SIA. The new intelligent metal detectors that the that were installed to Stahlberg International Airport, SIA, uh, last week have been causing numerous different problems. Most notably, the new detectors seem to mistake a few items such as DSLR cameras as possible weapons, causing false alarms. Castle Rock Tunnel Project nearing completion. Is that the tunnel that I obliterated? I probably don't want to photograph modern newspapers. But I'll try. I'm definitely saving before I get on that thing because I am not. I'm not confident I'll survive the trip. Ooh. Trying to look at the track to see the motion, and I don't see the motion. I don't see the connectors changing in any way. Oh, there they are. It's the far right. That's how tracks work. It's the, at the very end. I definitely want an auxiliary track or it's going to crash. But I feel like I'm endangering somebody by setting this up. This could be a problem. 
Uh, I feel s <laughs> this is this is a whole game of flipping switches that I would never switch in real life because I feel like I'm endangering people every time I do it. Nice ride. How would you know? Let's see. December. It's August right now, isn't it? What year is this? Uh, the only way to know is to check the start and end dates and compare it against which uh like which which December starts on a Monday. I'm not doing that. The same box gets around. I am going to die. Yep, I'm gonna die. Alright. Do we come in slow to potentially realize what I need to do before I- to survive this part? What could go wrong? Perhaps most alarming is that my input on this thing is just to go... Uh, you, all I can do is press E on it. There's no up or down button. So if I pr when I press it first, it'll probably accelerate even more first. Ah, uh, I kind of wanted to stop there. But I don't know... Can I? Eh. I don't think I can reverse in this thing at all. Here comes the loading screen. <laughs> I can see the end of the tunnel. The solid black.